This is Pine Leaf Needles for a casual stroll to Mordor. Today we'll look at how the Warden fights in mounted combat. The Warden has three disciplines. First is Red Dawn, the melee stance. Then we have Rohirrim, the defensive stance. And finally, Rittermark. This is our range stance. We'll fight this battle in Rittermark. This means that my default attacks will be Javelins. And that also means my attacks for some of my other skills will become Javelin rather than melee attacks. The fourth item I have here, Skill of the Erling Gas, changes depending on the last skill that I used. Therefore, if I use the first item, it becomes a mounted charge, melee attack. If I use Roar of the Erling Gas, then it becomes a Javelin attack. So let us go and fight this warg flanker. Now you notice this yellow dot here? This tells me where the enemy is. And unfortunately right now he is on my tail. I got ahead of him enough so I can whap him. One of the things that helps is being able to turn quickly. It's not an easy thing to get down when you learn mounted combat. But once you do, it's very helpful. Now you notice though that whenever I do a maneuver like this, I lose fury. So if you're in a position where you could gain a good deal of fury, without having to do turns like that, then excellent. Like that. I still need a little bit of practice before I get that down perfectly, but that gets you an idea of how mounted combat works on the Warden. Just keep in mind, you could either do it emphasizing melee or emphasizing ranged attacks. And even then, with melee attacks, you have the choice between defense or offense orientation. I look forward to be playing my Warden more in the future when Riders of Rohan is released. Until then, this is Pine Leaf Needles, signing off.